Tommy is safe. Tommy is sound. Tommy is fine. Hey guys, so today we are going to be watching The Last of Us episode 6 and yeah, I <laughs> we left off in episode 5. It was kind of intense. I don't really know where this is going. I feel like a lot of people have been pretty good about posting spoilers or at least putting spoiler warnings. So I haven't even seen anything about that. So I guess we'll both be surprised or I'll be surprised if you've already seen it. And yeah, everything about the season so far has been amazing, top notch, 10 out of 10, chef's kiss. Everything from the acting to the cinematography to the storyline, it's just, it's just been so good. Like I know the storyline already existed because of the game, but the way they translated it and adapted it to TV has just been so good. I literally cannot wait. Anyway, enough talking. We're just going to get right into this. <laughs> Three months later. Okay. So did they make it to Wyoming without any issues? Hmm. Why did you shoot him? The gun's all the way over there. <laughs> it didn't hurt me, by the way. Yeah, I got it. Not I got eyes. I oh, I ain't seen him. I haven't told you what he looks like. He look anything like you? A bit. But I ain't seen him. He's got a girl with him. <laughs> <laughs> no. Ellie. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> Joel, come on. Thousand. Who's this little psycho? Never mind her. <laughs> This is a joke. This is actually a joke. <laughs> like, Joel, none of this. I can't take this interrogation slash not really interrogation seriously. Because first off, they set it up with the wife who doesn't give a fuck. Then we had Joel and Joel's like, not flustered, but you know, Joel being Joel. And then Ellie coming down and making all these roasts against these people. Oh my God, this is so chaotic, but I love it so much. Hi. Came here before you were born, Sonny. Get the hell away from everybody. I didn't want to. <laughs> I love her so much. You can't go there no more. So you haven't heard the name Tommy? Nope. What about the fireflies? We get those in the snow. Oh, <laughs> the bugs, the people. There are firefly people? <laughs> 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 They're so funny. I love them. We never see who's out there, but we see the bodies they leave behind. Some infected, some not. Yikes. If it's still in the river, he's gone. Yikes. Yeah. Joel's definitely scared, for sure. Joel doesn't want to admit it either, but he's definitely scared. Wait, is Joel having a panic attack? Joel's having a panic attack. Dying? He's having a panic attack. Just go there. All of a sudden. No, Joel, you had a panic attack. Mm-hmm. It's okay. It's totally fine. It's normal. People have them. It's okay. They've been at it for three months, though. I'm assuming walking, which is kind of crazy. Kind of very crazy. Oh, look at these scenic shots. This is so beautiful. I'm telling you, the cinematography, 10 out of 10. So good. Ocean and ahead of you, there's a wall. Or else to look what up. I read everything I could in the school library. Neil Armstrong, Buzz Aldrin, Jim Lovell. You know who my favorite is? Sally Ride. Sally Ride. Okay. The best astronaut in ever. Well, think those thoughts, Ellie. She's scared. I have a sneaking suspicion. I don't, I don't know if this is a spoiler. If you don't want this potential spoiler, then click away for like a couple seconds. But I have a feeling that this vaccine is not gonna work. I don't know. I don't think so. 
It's either not gonna work or something's gonna fall through with them dropping Ellie off at the Fireflies. It's just bad news bears. I don't think they're gonna find a cure. I don't think there's gonna be a vaccine. Maybe there's not even a Firefly camp, so. Who knows? You know what though, for the longest time, I didn't know how to whistle. I think I barely know how to whistle now. Like, oh, that was a bad, <laughs> that was a bad example. Cause that was definitely a whistle. But generally I'm not good at whistling. I'm not, I can't whistle a tune. I can't hold the whistle for a long time. I can't do the cool different intonations of whistles. No, I'm not good at whistling. <laughs> yeah, you hear that? Yeah, it like dies out. It's so bad, it's so bad. Anyway. So that made electricity? Yeah. Don't ask me, I don't have a clue. <laughs> he could have. He could have. She would have definitely called him out on it too, so maybe not. <laughs> ah. They're, you're surrounded, so even if she was behind you, it really wouldn't help. We ain't looking for any trouble, we're just passing through. Off the gun. I really hope Tommy's in there. I hope Tommy is one of them. Oh my god, please. Puppers, don't do it. Is he gonna smell it? Is he gonna smell it? No. Oh my God, Joel. Okay, oh, that was, that was so scary. Aw, it worked out, it's okay. You didn't have to kill a dog, Joel. You didn't have to do that. It's bought itself, 10 more seconds. Joel. What are you doing out here? Wait, what do they know that we don't know? Do they know Tommy? One, I guess, kind of spoiler I did see is that Tommy is safe because HBO put that on their social media. I don't know if that actually means he is safe or not. I'm hoping he is. I'm hoping he's in this little town. Do they just have like spare horses? Tommy! Tommy is safe, Tommy is sound. Tommy is fine, but we all knew that. Oh my god, the brothers are reunited. Hell yes. I came here to save you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ellie's a little jealous though. I could see it. She's a little jealous that she doesn't have a family like that, which is true. I get it. It's been a while since we've had a proper meal. Actually, I don't think I've ever had a proper meal. It's amazing. Ellie. <laughs> uh, Ellie, let's mind our manners. Tommy knows. Tommy knows. We gotta be real careful about who we let in this place. It's all bark. We're just trying to scare off those who don't want to try us again. Well, you got a couple of nine year olds shitting themselves out there. Ellie. They say that you leave dead bark. I feel like something's up with this place. Something is definitely up with this place. Maria is family. Oh shit, congrats.
Are they married? Oh my god. Congrats. <laughs> that was the most disingenuous congrats ever. Oh my god, so much is happening. He has a new in-law. He found Tommy. It's just so much going on right now. You draw power from a dam. Got that working a couple years ago. After that, sewage, plumbing, water heaters, lights. This place actually fucking works. Sheep. We got a sheep farm. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I mean, it is that, literally. This is the commune. We're communists. No way. <laughs> he, wait, wait. Can we just look at the look on his face when he realized he's a part of a communist group? <laughs> All shared. Collective ownership. Look at this face. So, uh, communism. We're going to zoom right in. Ah. He's like, no fucking way. No fucking way I'm part of a communist group. <laughs> Look at his face. He's like, fuck. Fuck. I've been roped into this. Fuck. <laughs> no That's our newest one. Joel's having the time of his life. Long time. Tommy looks good, though. Considering they both aged the same amount, Tommy looks good. It'll be easy for us. Seeing as how you can headshot infected from half a mile away, which is a bunch of bullshit, by the way. <clears throat> Tommy's not gonna wanna leave. I can't go. Yeah. Tommy has a good life here. Why would he leave? Wrong people might show up. Is that what I am? Am I the wrong people? Joe, those I'm things I did, Tommy, those things that you just did. Yikes. Did, did those things to keep us alive. We did those things. They weren't things. We murdered people. Yikes. You must. I'm gonna be a father. It is a few months long. That's crazy. Damn. This changes everything. This literally changes everything. But I don't know. I feel like I'd be a good dad. I feel like this is so bittersweet. Guess we'll find out. I think Joel's mad too. I think he's a little jealous that Tommy. Just because life stopped for you. Yeah, I feel like Joel is a little jealous of the situation and that's why it's so bittersweet. It's his brother at the end of the day and he should be happy for him, but you know, he lost his daughter when everything was going down and he lost Tess trying to get Ellie across the country. And then now he finds out that Tommy, he has this great life. He's about to have a child soon. He gets to have all of that despite doing all the fucked up shit that they were talking about earlier. So I'm pretty sure this is so bittersweet and I get it. I feel Bad. And after all that time that he spent trying to get to Tommy, this is like what happens. Like he doesn't want to. Yeah, like after trying so hard to get to Tommy, Tommy doesn't even want to go with him. So now it's like, what was this all for? He wouldn't have lost Tess if he didn't go on this trip to find Tommy. And he wouldn't have been roped into this whole situation with Ellie either. So I feel for Joel. I feel for him a lot. Oh, he's about to have a panic attack too. I know it's a lot. It's a lot, Joel. It's a lot to take in. Oh, she probably looks like Sarah too. Oh. It reminds him of Sarah, though. They had Diva Cups back then? Really? Damn. Wait, when was the Diva Cup made? I could have sworn it was like a recent thing, no? Like in the past like few years? I don't know, maybe not a few years, but you know what I mean, like 10 years? Like way after this whole situation? Hmm. I'm gonna look that up afterwards. There's a whole lot you're not telling me. Good. Herein lies the point. Be careful who you put your faith in. The only people who can betray us are the ones we trust. I mean, damn, that's a good lesson, but why you gotta tell that to her? She's just a kid, come on. Grab your super fucking eggplant coat. Where are we going? The movies. The movies? Prepare and do what you do. You've had people go that way and come back. All of them. What is this? 
Mm-hmm. He's gonna tell Tommy you trust him? He's gonna tell his wife. It's hard to be myself. That's why I'm telling you. She's in Tommy, don't go turning on him now. He's your brother. I was so afraid. You think I can still handle things? But... Joel, it's okay. <laughs> Everything's taking a toll on him. Uh... No, you're not weak, Joel. I feel like you're just a little bit more empathetic and that doesn't make you weak. It's okay. Swallow your pride a little bit and just understand that it's okay to feel fear. It's okay. Remember, I just know that when I wake up, I've lost something. I'm failing in my sleep. It's all I do. It's all I've ever done. Oh my God. Again and again. You want me? Joel, it's not your fault. I have to leave her. Joel, I mean, it's what it's not your fault, right? Joel. To make up for the things we did. Well, here's your chance to bring your kid into a better world. You're younger than me. You're still strong. You said it yourself. You'll come back. You have to take her. Joel, now he's in this impossible situation. I swear. This must have taken a lot for him to ask Tommy to do instead of him. Now Tommy has this impossible choice. What does he do? What can he do? It's his brother, you know? <sighs> oh, get that man an Emmy. Oh my God. I feel like Tommy's gonna betray him though. Yeah, I feel like Tommy's gonna betray him though. I don't want him to. I'm rooting for you, Tommy, but man, oh man. Uh, She knows too. Everybody knows what has to happen. Oof. This is such a bad situation for everybody. At least at the movies, my guy. Oh, never mind. She's not at the movies no more. Listen. Uh, why are you here? I came here to talk to you. No, why are you still here? If you're going to ditch me, ditch me. What exactly did you hear? Oh, she like heard everything. You know, I stood up for you today because I thought. I made this decision for your own good. You'll be way better off with Tommy. She doesn't know Tommy though. Better than I do. Do you give a shit about me or not? Of course I do. Then what are you so afraid of? He's afraid of a lot of things. I'm not her, you know. Maria told me about Sarah and... No. He knows you're not her, okay, Ellie? I'm sorry about your daughter, Joel. But I have lost people, too. It's not the same. You have no idea what loss. It's not the same, Ellie. Everybody fucking except for you! Oof. But don't tell me that I'd be safe with somebody else because the truth is, I would just be more scared. I mean, Ellie is also pretty valid, too. You're not my daughter. I'm not sure as hell ain't your dad. Now come down. We're going our separate ways. So, at least go with him. At least go with them. Why? I mean, Ellie is totally valid in that, you know? Like, they've literally spent months together and she is the only stable thing in her life. So for him to just abandon her like that or like what feels like abandonment, you know? It's a lot. She doesn't know Tommy either, so how can she trust him? She's built a trust with, with Joel. Ugh. I knew this day was coming with the flashbacks. 
Wow, that was great cinematography with Joel just in the orange light. That was great. This show, I just, the cinematography is just top tier. I love it so much. Joel, change your mind. Go with them. Joel, are you there? You deserve a choice. I still think you'd be better off with Tommy. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> yeah. The instant choice. We all knew that was gonna happen, but damn. It's right off the interstate, should be hard to miss. Tommy's a betrayer, but I think this might be the last time they see each other. I think Tommy knows it too. Oh, they're only doing one horse. Come on. We all knew that Joel was gonna go. Deep breath in, slow breath out. You squeeze the trigger like you love it. Mm. Gentle, steady, nice and slow. You gonna shoot this thing or get it pregnant? You gotta do all that. It isn't gonna work, it doesn't aim right. He got it. You dick. <laughs> Not asshole. <laughs> He should have done in the O. He should have done in the O. That would have been more perfect. Oh, these shots, guys. Like, can we? I want to make them all wallpapers. They're so good. Which was building? That's right. Houses, stores, that kind of thing. We were called contractors. It's a contractor. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Yeah, you are cool. Everybody loves content. <laughs> Aww, Joel. This is so beautiful! Like, what? Guys, come on. Well, there's that. Well, how about that? Made it in five days. Easy days. I don't know what Tommy was so afraid of. Still time to find out. Yeah, there Still is. Find out. The contractor. <laughs> oh my god. I love their relationship so much. That horse must be tired. It's kind of sheep. Oh, see? I'm so closer to your dream. <laughs> Ellie, please. Are they not there anymore? Are these places, people would live here and like, what, go to mm -hmm. and stuff? Yup. Even though they were adults. Sort of adults. I think it was just as much about partying and finding themselves. Yeah, it is a bit of both. When I was a kid, I wanted to be a singer. <laughs> Shut up. Why is that funny? You gotta sing something now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't wait to hear him sing later. Must be from the old labs. <laughs> Look at this goat. First Damn. Time seen a monkey. First time seen a monkey. Oh no. Look it. Is something about to go down? Yeah. This does not feel like a good idea. You're not gonna tie it? Oh, if that horse dies, I'm gonna cry. What is going on with the fireflies? There's a packing list. Something to make what is going on? Well, at least it ain't clickers. What is happening? Oh my god. 
Can they get on the horse? He just killed him with his bare hands? Oh my god. No fucking way. No fucking way. No! <laughs> he got stabbed with a baseball bat. Oh my god. I think we're safe. Joel? Joel? No, 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 no. Th this is not how he goes. Joel? Joel? No fucking way. No, this is not how he dies. No, no, no. It's you. I don't know where the fuck I'm going. What the fuck? I is he messing with her? No, no. No, 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 no. I refuse to believe that this is how Joel goes. I refuse to believe this is how he goes. Nope. 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 We're just gonna reject this because this is not it. Nope. 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 Okay. Uh, okay. Oh my God, okay, so a lot, a lot has happened and there's a lot to look forward to. Oh my God, I literally, guys, I don't, wait, like actually though, I think the next episode, they're not gonna really get into that. I think it might like show up at the end of like the whole thing with Joel and him getting stabbed and losing a lot of blood and potentially dying. But I don't think he dies this way, right? From what I know, I don't think he goes out this way. I think he goes out a different way. And if he actually goes out like this, I'm gonna be a little upset because what? This is how he's gonna die? This is how he's gonna go out? What? I hope someone finds him. I hope like Tommy or somebody or somebody else finds him. Yeah, this episode, it was pretty good. I'm happy he got to reunite with Tommy. Tommy's gonna be a father. Oh my God. Super excited for Tommy. Tommy looks good after years of on the run with Joel, but you know, I guess that's what happens when you're the younger sibling. I'm the younger sibling, so that's why I say it like that. I'm just kidding though. I'm so happy that they were able to reunite. I'm so happy that Joel was able to find out that Tommy was gonna be a dad and Joel was then gonna be an uncle. That's pretty good, especially before he left. A lot of things have happened. A lot of things were said, but I'm glad that everybody has made up in the end. You know, Tommy said things that he didn't mean. Joel said things he didn't mean. Tommy apologized. Of course, Joel's not gonna apologize because he is too proud for that. And then he made it up with Ellie by going with her instead. There's no fireflies in Wyoming. So what is up with that? Yeah, I, again, I don't think Joel's dying that way. I refuse to believe it. I literally refuse to believe it. I guess we'll find out next week or in two weeks. There's three episodes left, so I guess we'll find out sooner than later. But I'm really excited for next week's episode. We saw the preview together and man, oh man, they're gonna finally, finally talk about Riley and what happened at the mall. I just know because Storm Reed is such a good actress. I just know I'm gonna be balling. I'm gonna be sobbing, crying in the club for this week's episode or like episode seven because her plus the inevitable sadness that's gonna come of it i don't know if i'm gonna be able to handle that i don't know i i know i say this like every single time but genuinely this show makes me feel things and makes me so sad a lot of the times because everybody is goddamn dying and can't deal with it can't deal with it but I will because I really like this show a lot. Let me know what you guys think, if you've seen the episode, what you think about it and everything like that. And I will see you next time. Bye.